Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. You're out in Glorious Fishing. My name's Dazza. Uh, Dazza? My name's Dazza. Your His name's Dazza. Dazza. My name's Danny. And together, we're the Turbot Kings. And we're the Turbot Slayers. And that's what I believe. And today, we're going to head up to the caskets and we're going to go and try and smash at some of these elusive flatfish, the Turbot and the Brill. As I say, I've got Dazza the Turbot King. He is a Turbot King. And I'm a Turbot King. And we're going to smash them. Let's go get them! We've arrived up the north end of Guernsey and what we're doing is we're just trying to collect some mackerel just before we go up there just so we've got a bit of flatty bait and what I'm doing is just with the surface lure, look there's bass everywhere, look. Yeah. Is he chasing my lure? Yeah, he's gone for your lure, yeah. No, no, I don't think he has. But I've just they're been all, hit, I've literally everywhere. just been hit, guys. When I say I've just been hit, I've just been hit. You want to see all the splashes behind us. Everywhere. Everywhere. Right, I'm gonna get them. This time, Darren, you watch. Straight in yeah, there. I'm at the back of the boat look, there, mate. Straight in there, look. Right, straight in the middle of them. Straight in the middle of them, ready? Come on. Feeding on the surface. I just got whacked just yeah. a second ago. Mackies. You got mackerel, yeah? Yeah. Nice. Nice eel, big eel. There's literally bass everywhere. Oh, exciting stuff. Come on. That is. Oh, I got it oh, then. Wheels. I got it. Chop one of them on live. There you are. Mackerel on, another one there. I'm going to get straight back down because it looks like there's a few markings. So if I can get straight back down, hopefully we can get a few more. Whew. Let's get them. We need to get up to that bank for turbot. Okay, everyone. We only managed to get two mackerel, but we'll be feathering up at the bank anyway. Let's go get these turbot and brill. Let's go. So, everyone, we've made it up to the casket southwest bank. And let me tell you, those overfalls there, they're pretty gnarly. And on a little boat like this, you've got to have your wits about you because you do not want that transom getting swamped and your engine. Because if that gets flooded, you're stuffed. And we're about 12, 13 miles from land. So, uh, yeah, we have to keep our eyes about that. We've got two rods down each for the turbos. As I said, that's the Turbot King. I'm the Turbot King. We need to catch the Turbot, otherwise we lose our Turbot King status. So. They're out there, we've got more boats up here with us. Keeney's up here, and I think the other guy is Vodin that's up here on his commercial boat. So we're in the right place, there's others up here. Hopefully we can get a few of these flatties. I'll bring you back once we get a few. We'll definitely get some. Well everyone, we've just arrived. We've got all the rods down. First drift, this is on the flappered sand hill. I've got a feeling it might be a dog. So we've definitely got a fish. Well everyone, I thought I had a fish on this one. I haven't got a fish on. Darren reckons there's a fish on the other rod. I hope they've the rest of the line, Yeah, let's hope not. I don't think it's this line, because this line's coming in. Definitely there's some weight on there, boy. Right? Yeah? Yeah. You beauty. Definitely weight. There's definitely weight. Let me get that side away from all the other yep. lines. Beautiful. Sort out these feathers, get these out of the way. Darren's head's in the way of the camera. Yeah. Truly apologise, guys. Let's take That's you off for this. Can't show you the bend, look. Not a lot of kicking though, mate. No, but that's that's what that turbot did yesterday. Flat. Just dead weight. That's what we want. You beauty, straight over the overfalls. Well we passed them now, but check that out, that is epic. Right, we're gonna be seeing the colour of his eyes soon, so I'm gonna put you back in the mount. 
you beauty. Hopefully it's a turbo. What was it? Like yeah, a that's a turbo. Like a kick, my boy. That's a flatty for sure, guys. I haven't got the GoPro on the net. Damn. First drift. Let's have Feels it. Feels like a nice fish, mate. Don't come off now. <laughs> come on. Feel something kicking, so there's got to be fish. <laughs> Beer turbot. It's a dog. Is it? It's a dog fish. Ah, damn it. Bloody Not dog rat. fish. Not happy with that. I thought that was a turbot. Well, it. it's a lot tighter. A lot tied. Right. Not very good. First drift, dogfish. Hopefully that changes. Darren's got a fish on here. That was big. The tope, is it? He just lost a big fish there. That was big. It looked big. <laughs> he pulled me around the back. It looked big. It definitely looked big. <laughs> Well everyone, fish on, we come up for a longer drift. This is this the dogfish, mate? <laughs> you want it, will be. Let's hope not. I'm not even gonna say anything, everyone. I'm not <laughs> even gonna say anything. Could well be a doggy. I've been having a few little taps for a while on that one, eh? Yeah. This is a dog, Dad. It certainly looks a little more weight than a dog. But then again, there's a lot of tide around here, so. Come on. Some colour yet? No, but it feels more than a dogfish. Well, let's hope so, mate. Might want to get the net. No, you won't. won't jinx it, you so. won't want to get the net. Oh, it's a lovely bit of weed, is it? It's a weed fish. <laughs> it's the Super ultimate cold. fish, that is. <laughs> Damn it. Right, we'll bring you back if we get one. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. Come on. That's on the live bait, you reckon? That's got to be a flat. Oh, no, I think we're going to line as well. No, you can't have. I reckon I have, it's not slack. Definitely a fish, so I can feel it. Yeah, that rod ain't far out. There's no way you can have that one. It's not big. Okay. But it ran, it ran yeah, well. I'd be amazed if it is a doggy running like that. Get the net, all right. You stay there. I can net him like this then. Hopefully it's a flat, there's something kicking. So. Yeah, this rod has gone slap, yeah, but I don't I've definitely got a fish, I can feel it. Yeah, I can see your rod go. Yeah. Sorry about this, guys. I'll get out of the way. He's got a nice uh, fish on. Well, let's hope it's not a monster, that's for sure. No, but I don't think that's a dogfish. It shouldn't be. It'd have to be a big one to run like it did. My line has gone slap, though, but I don't, there's, you know, there's definitely a fish there, 100%. And yeah. we haven't had nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Could be a tope. It's not a tope. No? Nah. Oh, oh, bloody hell. That's a fish. No that's a good fish. Good fish. I don't know what fish it is. You might have your line as well though. That's yeah, yeah, don't worry about that. Oh, we've got the colour. It's a platy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a grill or a turban. It's a big yeah, one. one. It's He's fish. taking two ox. Whose is it? It's mine. It's mine. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't know. That's a nice turban though. The double hook, we both got him. He has, look. Yeah. No, look, it's me. It's foul hook. Yeah, and yours ain't even in. Yeah, it might have fallen out though, eh? <laughs> look at that. Either way, we got one. We both caught it. <laughs> We're both turbo yeah. kings together. <laughs> Result. Uh, probably, I don't know how that's happened. It's either way, <laughs> it doesn't matter. That's about a four or five pound turbo, yeah. that. Nice little one. Start us off. Beauty, I can't believe we finally got one. We. 
<laughs> Joint effort. I don't know who caught I'm pretty sure Darren caught it and the hook came out of his mouth. But Either way, that, we'll take it. That was a bit surreal, that. It had both hooks in its gob. <laughs> anyway, we'll give you a better show of it. Fantastic one turbo in the bag. Get in. Oh, fish on. Daz has got a fish on. The tide is absolutely screaming, so I'm surprised he's actually got a fish. But it's got to be a turbot, because if a dogfish has gone for that in this tide, or a bass. Surprised it's a doggy in that speed. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Two and a half knots, eh? Yeah, 2.3 we're doing, so. Would be a bit surprising. No, it feels like it's come off, mate. Come off, is it? I think so, we'll have a look. Unless it's a bass coming with it. Could have been a cottle. Well, been, well, no. Wait there, it's a bass, I reckon. He reckons it's a bass, guys, so. I reckon, I reckon it's up with it. All right. Oh, there. there's my winch. And it's a bass. Come on. Yeah, in the bag. A little babby. Bazzle. Go chat. Show him off to the camera. Lovely little basil. I said, hey, if the tide's running that quick, I reckon we'll get them. Yep. You said as we came over that as well, we yeah. would. Dazza knows his stuff. It's a nice little bass, that. Fine bass. I've just pulled up my line and I've got the rat fish. <laughs> The dogfish, the rat of the ocean. Yeah. All right, let's get back up and get these turbot. Hello, everyone, fish on. I've just seen the rod going. So I just gave it 10 seconds, reeled into it, and we got a fish there. I don't know if it's a flatty, I don't know if it's a dogfish. Feels flatty-ish. There's not a lot of weight there though. There's not a lot of weight at all, Darren. It's the short rod. What's that there? That's a turbot, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Grab the net. Yeah, that's a turbot. Oh, it is. Smaller one. That's one. It's a turbot, mate. Aye, aye. Wrap around the other line. Bobby. It's a bobby. There's turbot number two. Fantastic looking little fish. That's an absolute beauty, that is. But far too small to keep that. We're going to have to chop that one back. But still good to catch another turbot. I'll give you a better show of that one as well. So, fine little turbot, that one. Beautiful, beautiful little turbot, but we're gonna let him go. He's far too small, that. They need to be at least a minimum size of 30 centimeters, so. Get him there, so. Oh, he wet me. Well, everyone, we were just packing up after I caught that turbot, and Darren is into a fish. You beauty, nice bend on that rod as well there, Dad. After 20 pound, mate, I love these ones. Hopefully another keeper-sized turbot. Oh, there was nothing, nothing, nothing. All of a sudden, it's just started kicking off. We've had turbot left, right and centre. Hopefully this is one as well. Now, the boat's turning. Feels like it. I've got the net at the ready. I still haven't set the GoPro up on the <laughs> net. Look, damn. So what I've been doing is putting the GoPro on the net so you guys can see us net the fish. It's a bit more tied now, so I can't really see it being a dog. But... It feels more like a flat. It, it feels like a flat. I don't want to curse it. No, no. Let's get him. Can we call it? I can't see. Here we go. What is that? What is that? Maybe a bass. I can't see it. It's gone round Keep the bringing other side. it in. Bring Fine. it in. I haven't got any line to bring in. It's a bass. Oh, it's a bass. It's a nice one as well. Aye, aye. Yeah, Keep us your eyes, bass. Look at that get for in. a bass. That's a nice one. Four or five pounder. Four pounder, no, five. Four pounder. No, that's a five pounder all day long. Look at the size of that thing. What <laughs> yeah, a beauty. I love the eyes of the bass. They look so evil. Big mouth on it. Look at that. 
<laughs> you beauty, that. Belter. Well, check that out for a fish. That. <laughs> oh, he's struggling. Yes, because he's got spikes. I don't want to get nipped. Full of power. Check that out, guys. Fantastic. The mouth on them. Yep. Big old mouth. <laughs> Darren can nearly put his fist in that. Oh, easy. Yeah. So we're going to go off for another drift and get a bass or a turbot. <laughs> Look at the overfalls. They're just starting to approach now. So this is where the water, a big volume of water, comes up over a big sandbank, and that's what we're fishing over, hoping to catch turbot and brill. Check those overfalls out. It can get very rough up here, so make sure you only come up here on calm days and not big spring tides, especially on small boats. Bigger boats are okay, but on the smaller boats, you can get very nasty up here. Well, there's one of the turbots that we caught. That's the biggest one of the day. It's a nice little turbot, that. You see their eyes at the top there, fantastic little eyes there, just poking out the sand, ready to ambush its predators with that big, big mouth. Now you tell, good way to tell turbot between turbot and a brill is a turbot, if you feel the top of it, you'll feel like hard nobbles of cartilage. That's the only way I can describe it. And uh, on a brill it will be totally smooth. You won't feel anything like that. And uh, brill are a little bit more oval where turbot are more of a diamond shape. So uh, yeah, fantastic. No brill yet, but we've certainly had a turbot. A couple of bass in there, another turbot. Fantastic. Great day's fishing. All around good trip. Before I give you a quick show of the rods we're using, we're using the Shakespeare Ugly Sticks GX2s. They're a 20 to 30 pound class rod, 7 foot 6 in length, and then we've just got the pole, Pen Squall 20 level wine there, and that's the Pen Squall level wine there, and then the Pen Squall 2 level wine. So, fantastic bits of kit. It's nearly time to go home. We've got the four rods out. Hopefully, we can get one more fish. A couple of nice greens, I reckon. One power up too. Everyone, fish on. Yeah. Is it a turbot? Yeah, it's a turbot. It's not a bad one. You got him. You beauty. I just lost another one on the other rod as well. The other rod took off. That's number three. You beauty. We're absolutely slaying them now. They've come on the feed. That's a nice keeper. That's probably a three pound turbot, that one all day long. Fantastic days fishing now. Whoa, you beauty, it's starting to kick off. All right, let's get that one off the hook and get that hook back down. Let's get some more. You beauty. Number turbot. Fantastic. Well, everyone, that's it for us up here at the caskets. Couple of bass, few turbot. Not a bad day whatsoever out with the Turbo King Dazza. The Turbo King strike again. Let's start making our... Well everyone, we've made it safely back to port and as you can see, this is the fish from the turbot fishing trip. Dazza had two lovely bass there, two turbot as well we've had. Fantastic, the turbo king strike again. Yeah. Well we did say we were going to get them, as I do guys, whenever we're out with Darren, we always get the turbot. He's the turbot king and I'm the turbot king. Copper went back as well eh? Yeah, well yeah, we had those couple of small ones as well, but fantastic trip guys, so I hope you've enjoyed it. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that like button and share on all your social media. It really helps the channel out and we'll see you next time.